No, no, you can't do that to me. You can't just show Rachel's name on a on a portfolio thing. No, 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 no. Space skip. Okay, let's see. You reported Nathan. 63% did it. Yay. You made fun of Victoria. <laughs> 26%. No, this is only the first episode of five, so... You made fun of Victoria? Fuck yeah, I don't care. He intervened to help out Kate. He came out of hiding to intervene. Yeah. Hmm. Friends that- do I have any friends? That actually played it? Oh, yeah. My friends did like me. <laughs> in most cases. <laughs> Next. You didn't want her to plant. What? Okay. You didn't let. You didn't sign Mrs. Grant's petition. I did not even see that. You helped Alyssa. Yeah, fuck yeah. You raised the insult on Kate Slate. Yeah. You watered your plant. <laughs> Fucking hell. I hate the plant, apparently. You didn't touch- No! Dana had a pregnancy test? What? You didn't touch Victoria's photos. Yeah, eh, who cares. You didn't write on the dirty RV. Apparently, you let the bird die. What? You didn't break Chloe's snow globe? What? What? Wait, what does that even accomplish? You didn't leave any evidence. <laughs> you read David's file. Yeah. Okay. Next episode. What? Do that to me? What the fuck? Chloe is the worst person ever. She is just meant to die. She is meant to die in this game. Like, everywhere she goes, she's dead. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. Don't insult me. Go on. Hey, leave him alone. Max? Chloe? It makes perfect sense I'd seen you today. Welcome home, Max. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Something happened to her. Wait. Is that grass? Tell me the truth. That's an order. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Max, tell me everything. Well. Hello, goodbye. But this is... We're gonna die. Hmm. <laughs> I don't want to snooze though. No. No snoozing. Do I have to snooze? No, I'm resilient. Okay, fine. What the fuck?
Wait, if Dana was pregnant, who was she pregnant with? Was it true? Oh, something goes. oh my god, this oh, is gonna be so goes. fucking weird. Take the songs though. That's way too much clothes to be sleeping with. I don't even know how to be sleeping in a dorm. I'm so wrecked after staying up all night. I could use my rewind to pitch a few more Z's, but maybe I better save my strength. Yeah. No amount of rewind will keep me clean. I still need a shower. Oh, a little zombie face. This is what happens when you research quantum physics all night. Okay. Let's see. All this crazy shit going on. It is so cool having Chloe. I am so not a rebel. I always like my bed to be neat and tidy. Thanks, Mom. Not it's really. It's fun to get some peeps together and play a real game Just instead of drama. a thing that I never do, so might as well do it in a video game. <laughs> Take a selfie now. No Take your power seriously. <laughs> Great. I admit, this is hilarious, but I shouldn't sink to Victoria's bully level. Fuck, I wouldn't. Drink up. I can bring you back. I hold the power over life itself. What do you mean, like... This... What do you mean this action has consequences? Oh, now I saved the plant another day. Shower supplies take. Okay, Max, let's hit the showers now. Uh oh. I wonder if I'll ever wear a watch again. Well, you should, especially now when you're fucking with time. Mrs. Hoida is still out sick. I heard somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. Ow! Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. Yeah. No, don't talk to people when they're brushing their hey, teeth. Max. Okay. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Of course. Anytime. That guy has issues. Mm hmm. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. 
Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. I don't know. Something is really sketchy. Like she is... I don't know. This seems like I'm gonna get paint something or... Something bad is gonna happen or get thrown over my head. I just feel it. I fuck too much with Victoria. And Kate seems suspiciously happy. What's up, Kate? School. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. Oh I'm sure my she had god. Fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yuck. I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Max Selfie thought she was a badass taking that picture. I should have beat her down. That was so uncool. She's jealous because Mark, Mr. Jefferson, knows I'm going to win the Everyday Heroes contest. He thinks Max is a joke. Um. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. <laughs> That's so mean. I don't get this. No, fuck that. I'm gonna throw. I better get dressed and go give back. Even if I done. can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Yeah. Holy shit. Kids are so goddamn mean. I won't disturb you. Hmm. <sighs> no fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up? After I find Kate's book. Why can I not hear? Oh shit. Nathan's revenge. Even Chloe told me not to go to the principal. Ta da! I do love a clean room. Very zen. No book here. <sighs> of course, she just spilled soda on Kate's book. I better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Be gone, foul soft drink. Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Oh, Lisa, I've left you on the brink of drought. I need to get dressed before I go there. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week, and he couldn't even rewind time. Hmm. Mm. 
Now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. As if I have to worry about being late anymore. I do have all the time in the world now. Erase this. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. I won't. It. I won't let the plant die. Uh, let's see. Where is Kate's room again? Kate's room. Oh my god. Fucking bitch. Kate? You in there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm in that. Kate really has a doting father. I feel so bad. Yeah, she looks really fucking suicidal. Fucking hell. Uh, hey, Kate. I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. What the fuck is a Vortex Club? Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. Do you know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. Oh my god, she got date rape drugs. doesn't sound like you. I can't see you partying with Victoria. I didn't. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine. And then I drank water. Not enough to get wasted. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember. Yeah, she got drugged so hard. I remember getting so sick hard. and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Oh my god, Nathan Prescott. Fucking hell. He's like the leading cause of ever. Oh shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. Yeah, of course he's, he's being nice. opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I oh woke up my in a room. God. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... What the Oh, this I don't even want to push her. Are you sure? Of course. You think I'm making this No, problem. I'm not what? thinking that. No, I'm just being deductive, as usual. Then what happened? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside Fucking my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. 
probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Thanks, Max. You can put my book here near my bag. Why did you step in? I hate you. I was hoping... Kate. Well... Why does... Because he saw the... You know... I know... That's awful. So, how did that happen? It's a long story. I'm still trying to sort it all out. <laughs> you have to tell me more than that. I swear to God, I had... No. I don't get wasted. I take a sip. Did somebody... I remember... Go on. Then Nathan prepped... Did you go? Definitely not. I'm not sure where I went. What do you remember about that? All I recall is driving for a long time. Go on. Somebody was talking. And? That's all I remember. So? I have no idea. Jesus, Kate. How do I get a... Kate? So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? Oh my god! I want to say look for proof, but I don't know if we're gonna find any proof on him. Fuck it, look for proof. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, oh my no, God. Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Oh. I so want to tell her to go to the police, but I don't think it's seriously Good gonna job, help. Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. Fuck. I have a f fucking feeling that she is gonna get commit suicide if we don't do anything. Like... Bullying on this level is not good for your mental health at all. I just wanna Fine, fucking break that down. Hmm. 
No emoji. I won't disturb you. <sighs> huh. I know where you sleep. Oh shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. No brook here. Fuck. Hmm. <laughs> no, you only have this on the other side. Never mind. Hi, bro. Oh, hi, Max. Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? I already had water to plan today. I can't tell if you're being serious. I don't want to drown in. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? I will later. I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. Hmm. Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. Hmm. Please, 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 Kate, don't commit suicide. Holy shit. Hey, Samuel. You're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. <laughs> I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. Okay, he's a bit creepy, I so but I think he has a trouble. mental disability. Later. Of course you will. Oh, that's the cardboard window! Shit! The window was still broken after I warned Alyssa about the rogue football. One little thing changed the course of that window's life. Hi, Taylor. Why would you even talk to me after the shit you pulled yesterday with Victoria? Well, sorry to exist, Taylor. On that we agree. Do you mind? Leaving? Thanks. Fuck off, Taylor. Consider this a polite warning. Fuck off, dude. Couldn't Max, care. It's over here. Warren, what are you doing here? Well, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. That was intense. That was intense. Everything happened so fast. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? Chloe Price. Friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question. Why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Uh, don't get him old. He's dangerous. I don't want you to get involved. You got me there, but lay low. Nathan Prescott is going to get his karma soon. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Aww. Let's go ape! Fuck 
Yes. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool. I'll text you the info. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Warren is cool. He's a cool dude. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. Wait, what the fuck is there a school bus for? I'm really living in a dorm? Shouldn't that be on school grounds? Oh, 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 okay, she's going away from school. But it's a Tuesday, right? I don't get this. Nice song,
he's in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Black Whale. He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but I'll stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? I saw him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. So, <laughs> now let's get down to the nitty-gritty. What do you want to eat? Bacon omelette sounds so good. I was dreaming about your bacon omelette. Now finish your coffee. I don't even drink coffee. One bacon omelette for the young lady sap. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Bacon at 12 o'clock high. But the lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stick. Wait, why isn't she here? Oh, okay. She's running late. In this moment forever. I guess hmm. I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Can I get some beer and bacon before I die? Okay, drink this the is coffee. A diner, not a bar. No beer? <laughs> this is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. Drink. No beer. What, what kind of dive is this? This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. Oh my I god. Keep going. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. Here, you'll love this. Yay! Like a bacon omelette. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, oh. mm, speak of the devil. Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, Mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she <laughs> did. Max is a good girl. Woman. Woman. <laughs> She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Oh my god. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town. Oh Who my god. Show in the jukebox? <sighs> now that that's out of the way. Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation. And I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. I don't know. I don't know. Do you have some kind of power or not? Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Girl. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Okay. So, panda key, cigars, money.
And... Warning ticket. Okay, um... You got this, Max. Now rewind and blow Chloe's mind. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Um, keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Oh my god, panda keychain. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Super Max. You do have that Irish luck call build. What else? Cigarettes. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? How the fuck should I know that? Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Okay, it was seven. Money. Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? It's like... One, two... It was 86 cents. 86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. Parking ticket. A parking ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? Oh my god, I don't remember. 10? 10.34 a.m. Booyah, Max can tell time. Oh my god. I think I just was like, saw something with 10 in it. Holy shit. So lucky. I literally just got chills all over my neck. You have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Great. I remembered. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. I will predict the future. No way. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Let's see. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Okay. She's going to the bathroom. That's the best song I've this heard This is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Daisy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Okay. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Let's see. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. Okay. Uh, trucker drops the his trucker mug. Trucker drops his mug, and Joyce rips him a new one. So, what happens next? Uh. Any answers? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and he answers it. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Um... Jeez. Justin Stop and Trevor so. are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good! Can't wait to see what happens! The jukebox goes crazy as the trucker tries to play a new song. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. 
Let's see. Mug. Oops. Dude, Did you, you right? break another cup? Really? No oh, refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. This is a sad day in Maxville. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Daisy Jones's locker. <laughs> so what are you waiting for? Okay, I'm speak. going to predict four of Trucker drops his mug. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new piece. So what happens next? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Mm. Stop stop. Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. The jukebox goes crazy as a butterfly. Oh my god, I don't remember. Bizarro, Max. But let's see. Let's see. Oops. Dude, Did you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a oh, dick. Oh, so cool. Bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. And it's a cockroach. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to predict four of And uh, trucker drops his glass. The trucker drops. So, what happened? And his... The cop is... Well, let's just see how... Uh, stops them. Just an entry. This is getting... And as a cockroach The jukebox crawl. goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarre, Max. Let's see. But let's see if everything happens like you said. This should be everything. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, wait. Really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. Now I'm gonna take this call and leave my brick. Hey, where is my partner? You called yeah. it. But he's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. You predicted a cockroach on the jukebox? I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that. Of course it's a toy. The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! Grow up. Uh. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. You did not just say that. <laughs> uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then let's go to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Oh okay, go on. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. Well, wait, pay for the meal. Okay. Yours. Can I pay for the meal? But, but can I pay for the meal? Nice. 
Hey, I kind of want to pay for the meal. Want everything. Yes. I think I'm ready for thirds. But you're only on your first. My stomach plans ahead. You're stuck in stock with a winner. Okay, Supergirl. Let's go to my secret place. Don't even answer. There's places to go and what we do. Come on, before mom starts some more shit. Let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead. Chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. Yeah. I need to answer this. Otherwise she's gonna commit hey, suicide. Kate. What's up? Please don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please go ahead. You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now. Let's rock. Sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. Don't care. If I think if we don't pick up, she's gonna die. at me this week that depends on you and how well you do in this phase of the test welcome to american rust my home away from hell raw and rough it suits you max do you know how awesome this is i get my best friend back and she's also super sized we don't know for how long exactly why it's time to have fun hmm. are you kidding after yesterday, I'm kind of over guns, Chloe. <sighs> Freaks me out that you have one. Don't you trust me? Yes, but not that gun. You have more power than an army. Don't be scared of my little toy. Besides, we need it for the test. <sighs> Strength? Yuck. <laughs> you are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer and guns? Nice combo. combo. You can handle it. Now go find us five bottles, please, please. Okay. I bet I could get on the boat from a higher location. Hmm. Oh, gross. So disturbing to see old syringes on the ground. Probably where he fucking leaves the syringes. All this rusted metal makes me feel serene. Am I morbid or just God? Uh, no. I'm not gonna look at that. Number one. Actually, oh, I'm gonna go. use the bathroom, so be right back.
resume. One through beer bottle. I wonder if Chloe thinks about her father when she looks at all these smashed up cars. Oh my god, can you stop being so morbid? Holy shit. Wow, sir. That looks exactly like the same dough from my tornado vision. That dough is the perfect photo op. This was an old school punk shirt. Oh my god, this though, though. Hmm. It's so quiet and primordial out here. Hmm. I wonder how many generations of fashion went through that washing machine. Yeah, no idea. Beyond repair. Rest in peace. <laughs> Rest in pepperoni. So sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. Hmm. Every car has its own tale and history. You know? This looks like a graffiti museum for Chloe and Rachel. I bet I can find out more about Rachel here. They really were besties. That could have been me instead of Rachel. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. Aww. That's so bad. That kind of hurts. Beer ball. Boom. Only three bottles left. I want to die. <sighs> Jeez. Who wrote this? Holy shit, that's... Fuck you. Yes, you know. Cole was here. Rachel was here. I don't want to intrude, but... I was here. Now we're officially a trio. Yes, we Lorenzo, yeah. Could use this board as a bridge. Doesn't look too heavy. Gunshot. Those shells look fresh. Shells. The fuck? Way heavier than I thought. Not worth it. That's... The Bigfoots were here. Three down, two more to go. Talk about finding a bottle in a haystack. 
There we go. Now we're gonna move this and take this. One more bottle to go. So sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. I said, I think she would not be still alive if we didn't answer the call. Sometimes you need someone in just that moment, so... Let's see, do I find some? There's one more bottle somewhere. No way! I totally remember going there when I was a kid. I loved the Hush Puppies. Now the sign is just Arcadia Bay junk. I don't want to go that way. I know there's a bonfire spot where people party around here. Hmm. Bonfire? I don't even know something that might even look like a bonfire. Is this it? No. There's a bonfire spot where people party around here. This is the scariest thing here. I have to find dirty ass bottles while you chill. Not fair. I have to prep the range, crybaby. And I've been tripping hard about where you got this rewind power. From God, or the gods. So, bow. We can make the world bow. Are you ready for that? 
Oh, yes. Once I figure out exactly how my power works. A god must doth know these things. Amen. And while you build an empire, I'm there to keep you on the path of badassness. And fun. Spin, rinse, and repeat. I'm just altering time and space. Oh, yeah, and history. <laughs> no biggie. You already altered history by saving my life, smartass. Let's see what else you can do. <sighs> what the fuck? Rachel songs. I wonder if Chloe would ever make me a mixtape. Oh my god. Aw, oh, poor thing. They left you here all alone. Washing machine, car wreck, hmm, can't go in here. There's a bonfire spot where people party around here. The Bigfoots were here. Hmm. I have no idea where this can be. I don't want to go that way. Thanks for the tip. Oh, campfire. Well. Okay, well, finally. Now I can deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. Let's see. Thanks, Max. Wait, one more for the road. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Max. A bit to the right, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, yes. Did you see? 
see that shit, Max? Duh. That was so fucking cool. Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Pull the trigger. Aim just a tad lower. Ready to plank. Aim slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative. Give me something to shoot, Max. Aim at that old blue plank here. I hate old planks. Yawn. I must rid the world of those bottles. Let's see you take a crack at that rusty barrel. Sorry, Mr. Barrel, your time has come. Listen to those fat bullet beats! I should rewind and help Chloe hit those bottles. Should I shoot? Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? Hella yes! Nice shooting, Tech. Now that's what I'm talking about. Satisfied? <laughs> like, never? So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target? Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Put a real dent in that front bumper. Goodbye, cruel bumper. <laughs> Jesus, I shot myself! Oh I my I shot myself! Back up, back Stupid up! Gun. Hold on, Chloe. <laughs> Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Let's see what happens when you shoot the gas tank. Step back, gas tank go boom. <laughs> boom! Car definitely down, but no bottle casualties. Okay. What the fuck? Well, Max? I want to see that windshield go down. Watch out for flying glass! Dude, I need a target before I shoot. How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. Uber cool. Okay. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. I don't know. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max! <laughs> Bad in an inevitable doom. <sighs> you freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? No. 
A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Much fun. Let me know when you Such well. God, this power really messes with my head. Glad I feel normal again. I'd rather go chat up Chloe. So I haven't read those yet. Oh wow. 30 pages? I will be reading them at the end, I think, when I'm done. Warren. Uh... We are so going ape. Hell yeah. Too late. Oh, Dad? Oh, okay. Okay. Looks like you're ready to lock and load. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo. Max is afraid. I know you can handle this. And I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. Oh, no. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute when you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend. And it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? Oh my god. Everyone is fucking psycho Please. in this game. Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Don't fucking shoot. Are you stupid? Come on, girly. Shoot me. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Thanks. You have until Friday to pay me, or I'll track you down with this interest. Have a good play, kids. You really stood your ground. I freaked. I don't like guns. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step shit will have his other gun sealed in an electrified bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held a gun on a human being before. So what? Uh, am, oh, am I supposed to I know, shoot Max. him? Really. I'm actually relieved it worked out this way instead. And there are more guns. I'm not gonna there. shoot him. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Oh man. Frank took Chloe's gun because of me. Yeah, and I'm not gonna shoot him. Wow, sir. Chloe's waiting to go for a walk. Wink. I can't believe you basically gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me, especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. And I just liked having that gun, man. 
Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. Are they stupid? Can like, we build another legit retarded? Keep the world out? We need a new secret Who the hangout? fuck lays down on train tracks? Are you okay, Max? Seriously, Chloe, this is scary. What if Frank tries to track us down? I'm sorry, but Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Yeah. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hang out. Hung out. You don't mean you. Ah, oh, no, we didn't Hello. have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. Hello, Fred. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? Be careful. I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy without him eyeballing us, okay? That's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens. And it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. What? Why? I bet she would hate me. You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at Look night. Look at the beat poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Spock. Awesome, it's not locked. Come on, Max! Hurry! I better find the tool to cut those wires. Cut the wires? Please get me out of here! Oh my god. Please, please, please. Push! Damn, something is blocking the drum. Oh my god. <sighs> Fucking hell. This wedge locks the drum in place. Oh my Max, god, open. Shit, I can't budge it at all. Can we just take a break? Max, oh my god. Okay, let's see. Um... Please, get me out of here! 
Okay, crowbar. Take. I can definitely use this bad boy. Okay, crowbar. Max. Open here. Crowbar. Uh, score. Okay. Crowbar. Uh, open drawer. Oh my god, yes, take. Now I can pull a total MacGyver. Oh, wait, the wire, the cut. Red. Oh my god. The classic one. Open. Uh, uh cut. The but which wire to cut? Red. Now that's the right cable. Yes, like always. Pull. Yes, I did it. Okay, the tropes help me. Okay, you saved me again. Cut the red wire. <laughs> now we're totally bonded for life. Damn, that was close. And only needed three Aren't rewinds. You away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. That's so nice. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Explain what? Snow equals the ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. No one even start I'm talking like about quantum physics. Small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? Nope. We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar. Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. They're such a cute couple. I ship. But Warren and Max is really cool as well. Hmm. I don't know which one I ship more though. Warren is really nice though. Yeah, Warren with Chloe is best friend. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wondering. Uh, no. Uh. So are you going to that vortex? Yeah. Bully free. Zachary. Hello, Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As yeah. long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sext in Victoria. I won't. I won't. That's what Victoria wanted. Yeah. I noticed she kind of set up her own drama. Even if it fucks her over. Weird. She doesn't have to, though. That's what I don't get at all. When she's hot, rich, talented, what more does she need? Anyway, Drama. See you at the game Friday, Max. Apparently. Seriously. Hello, climate change. End of the world. Party. 
Uh, I don't know if that's a good idea to have a party for end of the world, but... Join us, or die. Never. <laughs> well. Who are you? Trevor surveys his domain. Oh, Trevor. Uh -huh. Next, can we talk? Yes. So we I can know talk. things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? Uh, no. No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All mm -hmm. you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. Oh. It will take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to I find think actually he... Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? I think he's you know on to something that, that females are I don't want to fight disappearing, with kind of. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. So That's I think he was trying to question Kate. So did she... Like, if she knew something, but he took it too far, I don't know, anymore. I just know Nathan is a fucking bitch and a half. Sit down. <laughs> I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? So you can't help me? I'm trying. You have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Okay, okay, okay. 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 You're going to the bathroom, right? No, you're not? Why are you leaving Stop. school, Kate? Don't come near me. Okay. Fuck Kate. Ah, she's got a suicide or something. Fuck. Excuse me, Max. I was here? speaking I'm with you. Worried. Is everything okay? Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <laughs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? No. Everybody knows. That's why I wanted to see you. Kate is being humiliated daily. What if Kate brought this on herself? What? She means well, but... Are you fucking person. serious? She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes! Oh my yes, god! I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. I don't think care! You told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. And that was, yeah. It did happen. 
Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girl's bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be as popular as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. No, fuck Hello. you. Yes? Fucking hell. Um, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. No! Fuck you. I hate you. Yeah, okay. See you later, Renza. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Uh, potassium. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go... Potassium. Potassium it shall be. This works? You get a free hug. Weird science. A tape that didn't work. Yes, I am a scientist. Fuck. I don't know if that would work. Okay, what if it's sodium? No, 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 no. Can we? S um. Hey, Warren. Maxwell. Ask him. Have that. I mm. actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a shitload. See? Look at that smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. Let's do this thing. <laughs> she blinded me with science. Okay, so what happens if we do sodium? I have a vision. Go diem. Go diem? That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is. Damn. Zip. Nope. It's potassium. Hey, That's a hundred percent. Heck. Asking me. Have that. Lots of potassium. I See? She blinded me with science. Excuse me, Max. Bob. I'm only Bob. Just between. That's no st I said Of course My All wait And Max? I assume Kate is freaked out by all of this She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis What if Kate brought this on herself? Are you fucking st no. Wait. No. I just don't want Kate Marsh to be the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? With all her... I miss Rachel. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious... So you don't believe me? Okay, let's see. I need to make this a good conversation. Excuse me, Speak. Max. Bob. I'm only Bob. Just between. 
That's no secret. I stepped. Oh. My word is. Always take the shot. And Max, I promise. I assume you know about this viral video. What if Kate brought this on? No. Rachel. With. Now, this is a sleep. Hmm. I hope so. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Bow, bow, bow. Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh, I'm sure she'll report us to the principal. Like I give a flying fuck. Or she'll run to Mr. Jefferson like he gives a shit. Like anybody does. That's a great sketch of Dana. Daniel is the real deal. Uh oh, post. Is such a little. Shh, I think she can. Dana is ready for her 15 minutes of fame. No time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. Stella is smart to stay out of all the drama. I guess I'm out of time to turn in a photo for the contest. Irony. Arcadia Bay looks way more majestic here. You guys are fucking retarded. I'm so gonna post. If I can, I will post that fucking picture of Victoria. You guys are fucking retarded. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. And paparazzi. I want that photo whore or I get nasty. Too late. Oh, burn. Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. In fact, shit's just starting, Max. Assholes. That's fucking weird. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. You know what? Stand up. Stand up. Oh my god. Stand up. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier, and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. We have a lot to cover today. Oh my god. So little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. No smartphones in class, Max. Put that away. <laughs> Usually, people need something to judge so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking of participation... I guess Kate will miss class now. I'm worried about her. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my- Yo! Some crazy shit is going down at the girl's door! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. 
Don't tell me she killed yes, herself. Yes. Are you fucking kidding me? No, 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 no. No. Oh, oh God. She can't die. She can't. Ugh. Not again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. Oh my god! God, please. Yes. Kate, please. doing here max stop don't come near me not now it won't work i don't have any power now i have to do this by myself max seriously don't come near me i will jump okay okay i'm right here kate please oh well, max me. i know you want to help me i love that you stepped up to david but it doesn't matter now nothing matters hello You matter, and not just to me. I do want to believe that. Kate, your life is still yours, and we can get through this together. Let me help, like I helped by erasing all that crap people wrote on your room slate. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. I'm here I'll for you. I'll always be here for you, Kate. My new motto is, friends come first. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning, I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. I'm gathering proof that Nathan Prescott drugged you, and you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Nathan Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. You have oh to my God! Soon, then straight to the police. Think of it like we're cleansing Blackwell. You do have my back, Max. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So, I want you to come with me now. Please, you don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. And then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm already on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Kate, 
There are billions of videos out there. Yours will fade away like white noise. Oh God, please, Max. You haven't seen the looks I get. Or the laughs. I understand, truly. I get bullied too. But this is a blip. Yep, my life is a blip. Blackwell taught me I'm worthless. I'll prove it right now. Kate, you can't do this to all the people who care about you. No, nobody cares about me. Nobody. Kate, I saw that card from your father. You can count on him. He clearly loves you without question. Dad does care, even though I hurt him. He's the only one I know who believes in me. See, you're not alone. And nobody down there wants to see you up here. This isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. Nice try, Max. But God put me on this roof. Oh my god! I can't do this! Uh, Matthew. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Matthew 11, 28. I can't believe you quoted one of my favorite passages. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Oh my god. What are you talking about? You saved me from talking in class. Now, I know today was difficult for everybody, but I'm so proud of the way Blackwell pulled together to save a young girl. <laughs> Blackwell didn't do shit. Of course, you're quite the hero for getting Kate to come down. I didn't do much. She's modest. Like a real hero. Yeah. Real hero. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take Oh my, my god. I take the well being. Fucking hell, I actually saved her. What happened today Holy should never shit. be all of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those root doors should always be locked. That's just standard. And the of, no, it's really amazing this game. And that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through. But Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. Oh my god! No! I, I can't tell on David. I can't tell on David because I know Chloe ha they had economic problems and he will be held they will be like oh we should we should get rid of you bad security guard and like Jefferson fucking did make her cry and he told her she was the one like responsible and Nathan if I say I'm gonna get killed if I tell Nathan Dennis. Like, I will be dead. I think fucking Jefferson is gonna have to take the fall for this one. I don't care if he's a good fucking jerk or a photograph or whatever, but he's gonna have to take the fall for this. Fuck! I saw Mr. Jefferson talking to Kate right before our class. Then she ran off crying. Mark, I do know that Miss Marsh has assisted you on class events. Kate, Miss Marsh has been very withdrawn lately. 
I assume this awful video was the cause. I hated seeing the students laugh. Yeah, bullshit. She told just me Max was the only one who believed her. Would take her calls and actually listen to her. She shouldn't have asked to be on video macking with some dudes. You ass. She didn't ask for any of this. No, on the contrary. Max was right to bring this up. Now, I wanted to help, but I guess I was too late. Well, now, this is problematic. The publicity is rising, and perhaps you shouldn't represent Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes contest in San Francisco. Are you serious? <laughs> I am. We don't need any negative press about that event. And we need to involve the Academy in possible disciplinarian measures for you. I understand. There are bigger things at stake than me. The life of a young girl, for one. Maybe you should investigate other staff members. Max told me she knew things about Mr. Madsen. Let Max speak for herself. Everything we talked about here will be looked into. All right, Miss Caulfield, please <laughs> sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. <laughs> Fuck it! I'm gonna do it once! I'm gonna fucking do it! I'm gonna fucking pin it on Nathan and get killed! Let's do it! I'm gonna get killed? I don't care! Fucking Nathan! Fuck you! All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're a liar. The field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Yes, Careful, Kate survived. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further oh, notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you told us. I'll continue this investigation. Fuck yeah! Nathan getting killed! I know I'm gonna kill for this, but yes! Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. I'm so dead, by the way. Nathan is gonna kill me. I, I'm a hundred percent sure he's gonna kill me. <laughs> I couldn't even believe it was happening. It was literally slow motion as I grabbed her hand. And then I could feel her grabbing mine. Max, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen. Ever. You reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. Not quite. Look at me. I'm a mess. You're glowing. Seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. I'm still worried about Kate. She did try to kill herself. All over a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. So you watched it? Just one. And a half times. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm well, Fred, you're always guy. welcome to but watch this one. <laughs> Nathan did scare me today. And Madsen is a straight up dickhead. 
So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? The weather confirms this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. Aww. Warren! So I believe cute! You I'll believe anything this week. Yeah, I shape Warren and Max. Fuck yeah. They're the greatest couple. Yeah, I did not want David to get kicked. Like, even if David is a fucking asshole, I don't want him to get kicked from his job. Same thing with Mark. Like, me, he'd be a douchebag. And didn't do shit, and he implied that it was her own fault. But Nathan, fuck him. <laughs> Why is Nathan in her room? Oh, which one is the farewell episode? Kate in the fucking ER. Oh, okay. I hate that this is the last like freaking thing of the episode wait what what the fuck I don't know who's Diane is. Oh my god! This episode! Okay. Mm. Yeah, 81%. Yeah. Oh my god! People actually shot Frank? What? <laughs> and 60. 2% saved Kate's life. Uh, blamed Ethan, 72%. Okay, but with my friends. Okay. Yeah. I am. <laughs> it's okay to go to the police. 81% wait for more pills. 70%. Yeah. 80% saved Kate's life. Yeah. My friends are best at this game. 90% <laughs> blame Nathan. <laughs> Nobody gave two fucks about telling the goddamn bastard he did it. Oh, next, you watered your plant. 
Yay! You helped Alyssa. You raised the length to case videos. Who the hell doesn't do that? You were friendly with Taylor. Who the hell was Taylor? Mm -hmm. Acceptance warrants invitation. Yay! You wrote a message. 50-50 with my friends. You didn't tamper with the rail wax. Wait, you could do that? <laughs> there was multiple ways of actually doing this? What the hell? You didn't gain entry to the Vortex Club. Told on David to... Yeah. Oh! World! It's only 77. Hmm. What the fuck? 